Hello, welcome to BB YouTubers, and today I will be reviewing and reacting to the Captain America Civil War trailer 2. Sorry, this is late, but I had to get it done eventually, but I just didn't have time because I was on spring break when this happened, so I didn't have time to do it, but now, I'm doing it. So, thumbs up. Alright, let's get this trailer started. Okay, here we go. Try to save as many people as we can. I like that line. Oh, that's a good shot. That's a good shot. That's the American way right there, man. America. America. New York. Avengers. Um, what's it called? Oh, there's footage. Okay. Sokovia. Sokovia. Okay. Now? Captain, people are afraid. That's good. That's, That's a child? <laughs> it's the child. Awesome. Whatever form that takes, I'm game. I'm sorry, Tony. If I see a situation point us out, I can't ignore it. Sometimes I wish I could. Sometimes I want to punch you in your perfect, perfect teeth. I love that line. It's a good line. Oh. Oh. <laughs> the safest hands are still out. That's like a kill shot. They're not gonna show death in the trailer. They would. They wouldn't do that, would they? I feel like Black Widow's gonna be the Spider-Man character in this, like in the comics. Switches sides. Oh! You just started a war. Oh, Black Panther looks so good. No. <laughs> Oh, Captain America, man, I love you. <laughs> All right, I've run out of patience. On the roof! <gasps> hey, everyone. <laughs> okay, well, that trailer looked amazing. And um, now I'm just going to review it, go over some shots in the trailer. I took a little break to get into myself, like, see, like, what is here that I could review other than just saying the trailer looked great. Uh, this shot is one of my favorite shots in the trailer. It looks so cool. It's just Bucky hooked up to some machine thing. I feel like there's going to be... The movie's going to have a huge presence on Bucky and him once being the Winter Soldier and now kind of being like back to Bucky Barnes again. So that's going to be very interesting to watch. This shot here also looks like it'll play kind of not, it doesn't have to be huge, but it has to be some part in the movie because, um, what's his name? General Thunderbolt Ross? He just showed them Sokovia and this is Scarlet Witch dealing with inside of her Sokovia because that's where her brother died Quicksilver and um and it just and I love how Captain America he just goes and says alright that's enough like he doesn't want to see these in, these guys in pain anymore from the security footage now this shot now this, I think, will 100% play a pivotal role in the movie. This is T'Challa, also known as Black Panther. And in this movie, he, um, it looks like the building he was in just blew up and now he's just like, like on the ground, like crying or just hurt or something like, like he must have got hurt or something. And I think that building, it looks like kind of like, 
I also saw this on the internet, so don't tell anybody. But, uh, uh, I think it's going to be, like, a, a United States building, like, I can't remember, UN, UN, yeah, that's what it's called, where all the areas combine, and Wakanda comes in with T'Challa and his father, T'Chaka, <laughs> that's his name, and, um, I guess the building's blown up by somebody, maybe Crossbones, Mary, maybe Baron Zemo, I uh, hope we get to see him soon, um, maybe it was even Bucky, we don't know, maybe that's why he, Black Panther was chasing down Bucky earlier in the I mean, later in the trailer, so, I don't know, it's just what I thought. And now, this. If you have read the comic book storyline of Civil War, you will know that there was a prison that Tony Stark, Reed Richards, and Hank Pym built. Uh, it was called Prison 40, was either 42 or 43, I'm sorry, I'm sorry that I can't remember, but um, I have the comic right over there, maybe I should just go get it. Sorry guys, I can't whistle, but I'm still looking. Uh, found it, finally. Yep, it is Prison 42. And this is what I think the MCU's version of it will be since they don't have the rights to the negative zone where Prison 42 was in the comics. Owned by Fox and ruined by Fantastic Four. Or fan Four stick I don't know. Yeah, like, like I'm saying, this is probably their version of Prison 42. It might even be called Prison 42. But it's an underwater one. Maybe it's the raft. Uh, it just, I don't know. It just stood out to me for some reason. Here we go. Like I was saying earlier, T'Challa, Black Panther, is mad about something. And maybe wants the Winter Soldier dead. Because in this, well, you can't tell in this shot. But in this clip, you can see um, Black Panther running after Winter Soldier and slicing his uh, motorcycle back tire and Captain America's chasing him so maybe Captain America's like Bucky no and then it's just like and then like I don't know I don't know what I'm saying but Black Panther's just like no man I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill this guy man he like probably killed my father I don't know I have no idea what I'm talking about now <laughs> Oh my god. See? Slicing the tire. Meow. Now this thing that Tony Stark invented, it's just an iron hand where you can just go and it's on. That is cool and won't play any pivotal role, but it's cool. This shot, you probably can't tell what it is, but it's part of the war machine getting hit and falling to the ground part. Um, it, the trailer sets it up to look like Bucky goes, and just shoots him down, but if you look at the shot, that's not what hits him, that's an arc that looks like it comes out of Vision's head, that is the same color, it's the same beam, but Vision is on Iron Man's team. Hmm... Now this. A lot of people think War Machine is dead. I do not think he is dead. They would not show his death in the trailer. So, I believe that, I believe this part, this doesn't say what I was saying earlier, but I think this part comes after the parking lot scene we see at the end of the trailer. And because War Machine was with Vision, it looks like Vision knocks down War Machine, but he's not dead. He's not dead. You know who will be dead, though? Hawkeye. No, really, that might be a quint that might be a real thing, but um, I think Captain America will. One word. Yes. His suit is bulletproof. I can't wait. Scarlet Witch is destroying Vision, like just going, like crushing him. That's what, 
I don't think she's crushing him, but you know what I mean by whenever I say crushing. Like, but look right here. Right next to Scarlet Witch's legs. Who do you think that is? It's Hawkeye. Yeah, he might die, but who cares? I mean, it's just Hawkeye. I mean, it was like a Netflix series of him, but in the movies, no, just flat out no. Did you expect me to go this whole way without mentioning this? Because I won't. Okay, here's the next shot. No, I'm just kidding. We're going back to Ant-Man on the Arrow. This is the second best shot in the movie. This is the second most comic accurate thing in the movie. This is flat out amazing. I cannot wait to see Ant-Man riding Hawkeye's arrow. Okay, now really at the shot with Crossbones fighting Captain America. This is going to be an interesting fight. I think it'll be at the beginning of the movie. I don't know where this is. Some people say it's Wakanda. But uh, Chadwick Boseman, the guy who plays T'Challa, says there will be no Wakanda in the film. So it can't be Wakanda. Here's the basketball net. I'm just kidding. No, it's a chair. Idiots. Is it a chair? I'm just kidding. Yeah, it's a chair. But, um... This is, I just think it's a cool shot for this reason. Right there, crossbones. I think his costume looks amazing. And also, Captain America dies in the comic book. And is shot by who else? Crossbones. I think that's why he's in this movie. Because he's just going to go and just kill Captain America. Just a plain old cool shot. Ah, look, he's gonna repulse my head. Ah! I could do this all day. But let me review this trailer, because I could watch it over and over. My life now has meaning after seeing this. Webs. Web-covered hands. It's coming. In case you are wondering where Blake went, he died. Okay, okay, I'm back. Okay. No, I'm going down again. Alright, bye. Okay, but in all seriousness, this suit is the best Spider-Man suit I have ever seen in my life. If you want to see my full detailed review of the suit, go to my uh, previous video. Um, what's it called? MCU Spider-Man suit review. I think that's what it's called. Something like that. Just go over to the rest of the baby YouTubers uploads and check it out. And if I die again, um, someone bring me to Raz. I'll go. Thank you. The eyes move! Eyes move. Excuse me for a second. Oh my god, yes! I hate it. Just kidding, I thought you, in case you thought that was real, because I love it. Why must it take so long for awesomeness? <laughs> Not ever Superman's coming out like next week, why can't Civil War? I mean. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> I just did that to show off my shirt. All right, this was my reaction slash slash review of the Captain America Civil War second trailer. If you like, go check out some more of our videos. We have the I have the MCU Spider-Man suit review. Um, we have done funny dub smash collages, which are very pop, which are popular on our channel, of course. Jerks. We also do Infinity stuff, Disney Infinity. We do gameplays. Um, so just uh, check out our channel for more, and uh, I'll be hoping to do um, more trailer reviews and movie reviews on my new channel that I will be creating pretty soon. So um, subscribe on. Let's see, today's March 19th, uh, so let's say March 22nd. Subscribe on March 22nd to Robertson Reviews. Thank you so much for watching. Stay after this.
Freaking finally, man, that took forever.